Good morning everyone, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Crisis Core Reunion. This is immediately after the last uh, video, because I'm trying to make longer sessions, or just sit here for longer times and make videos, even though I cut them shorter. Anyways, uh, we dealt with the treasure princess, now I'm just going to look, have a quick look at these things. It's a level 4. Ooh, Lunar Harp. Reward. Um, what's here? Precious things. A Thunder Armlet. And here we have to hell and back. That's a level 5. That's a no-go. Anonymous hint. A level 5. No-go. Thing is, level 4 is already like on, on, on the... On the... How would I say it? On the cusp of being a bit too difficult, maybe, for my current build. So, I think we'll continue with the main storyline and level up a bit more. In that sense, let's go with set one. We have up in darkness in the last episode. Uh, Blizzard Blade though, hmm. what was the other one? This was, this was, set number three was the physical, physical one. HP up, HP up, power wrist, yeah, 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 barrier dash. Okay, and this one is like a mixture of both. It's, um, has magic, it has cure and barrier. Muscle belt. Boosts MP, attack, and magic. It's lightning to attack and some abilities. Hmm. Grigri bag. Spirit, 20 prevents curse. HP, ooh, HP, 30. MP, AP, prevents stun. Attack, vitality. Plus 40. What do we have? We have boosts attack and magic, add silence to attack and some abilities. Silence though. Hmm. Let's change this to the lightning ring. It's lightning to attack. Muscle belt, attack and vitality plus 5. I think that's too little. Instead, let's go with. Attack. Uh, let's go with vitality, I guess. Because this one was more on the attack one, right? And this number one would be more like a tank, I guess. Fire amulet, boots, MP, vitality, and spirit. Health damage from fire attacks. Have I encountered any fire attacks as of late? I don't think so. Um, let's go with AP plus 4 to prevent stun. AP is actually pretty necessary. But prevent silence, MP, HP. You know what, since we have the darkness attack, right? It consumes HP instead of anything else. Enables special attacks that expend HP to deal non-physical, non-magic damage, so we will focus more on HP, because that is the resource used for that one. Okay, let's go. By the way, about this cure... Hmm... I would like a Kuraga, to be honest. But that's fine, I guess. For now. And let's save the changes. And let's continue on the main mission. The exit? That door. Going already? I mean, I've hung around for quite a while. Yeah, I should go. 
Well, thanks again, Aerith. Yeah. Are you yeah. always here? Yeah. So, where are you going? Hmm. Don't know. I'll take you. Where? Hmm. Don't know. You just want to spend more time with me. <laughs> yeah. Huh? What? We're under the plate, right? Sector 5. The slums. Yeah. Main Street's over that way. There's lots of people. And you can go above. Ah. Well, I should be good once I make it there. All right? Lead the way. Okay, let's go. Wait, wait, wait. Don't go. First, we check behind if there is anything efficient now. You think flowers would grow here? I got something. May. Okay. Personnel announcement 0104. Effective today, Zach Fair has been promoted to soldier first class. Whoop. Nice. So. My question is, do I have to walk slowly? What's the map like? Yeah, you know what, let's let's walk slowly. You think? Uh, this is the annoying part of, you know, walking with NPCs. They don't walk at the same pace as you. Come on, there is, come. There we go. Zach, let's run! Don't worry about it. I'll protect you. I've got this. You've got this? Oh yeah. Stay back, okay? Activating combat mode. Oh my oh, goodness! Yes. You're amazing! <laughs> You're so strong. <laughs> Strong. Like a monster, right? Zack? What's wrong? Nothing. Now, let's move. Hey, I looked good, right? Hmm. Hmm. What? Don't know. Come on, flatter me. <laughs> All right, Zach, let's go. Uh, uh, hello. That darkness, though. People who come from the slums, they fall into one of two categories. They either hate Shinra or they idolize it. I'm the latter. One day, I'll find me a Shinra executive and live the good life. Shouldn't we get going? More monsters will come. Hey, wait! So, here we are. Yep. Hmm. Something wrong? The slums look just like any other town. <laughs> of course. Lots of people live here. Hey, inside that gate, there's a market. There's so many great shops there. My soft drinks. 
bug one, get one. Bug? Buy one, get one free. Yep. The market's this way. Okay, coming, coming, coming. It's kind of stuffy here. You okay? Huh? I know why. There's no sky here. Uh, we don't need this sky. You're under this plate all the time. You normally miss seeing the sky, no? Sorry, I'm not normal. How's that? The sky frightens me, like it's sucking me in. Weird, right? Normal is overrated. You think so? I know. One day, I'll show you a pretty sky. It won't be scary. Trust me, you're gonna love it. Hmm. Now then, the map. There's something there. I really want to go. You have new mail from Kunzel. Hollander's t-shirt. It seems Hollander's favorite t-shirt is the one with the logo of Banura's famous canned apples. Can a guy love apples that much? Or do you suppose he has other ties to Banura? Apparently, with all the confidential information they handle, guys in the science department aren't allowed to leave the company even if they screw up or lose out in the rat race. And that puts them under a lot of stress. Maybe Hollander's t-shirt helps them relieve some of that, huh? Hmm. This guy. Uncle, when are you coming back? What's wrong? Looking for someone? No, I'm waiting for Uncle to come back. He said that there's lots of monsters right outside of Midgar. So Uncle went with a bunch of people and left Midgar to beat up those monsters. And he hasn't come back? Coming back. If I keep waiting here, he has to. Uncle's a really nice person. When I told him I wanted to work for him one day, he smiled and he said, okay. If you keep believing, he'll come back. I know it. Yeah. Right. New mission has been added. Mission number of M214. Okay, good to know. Good to know. And I guess we'll go. Yeah. Are the slums strange to you? Hey, wait! Huh. Looks like an interesting place. Yeah. Want to take a look? Oh! Oh, sorry. Be careful, huh? Okay. Sorry again. Man, that hurts. Huh? Wait. What the? What's wrong? My wallet's gone. <gasps> oh, no. <sighs> <sighs> that little brat. He just stole my wallet. Aerith, wait here, okay? I'm gonna go catch that kid. And get my wallet back. Bruno's his name. Bruno? You know his name? Yeah, I know him. Just a little. He doesn't do things like that. But... If he really stole from you, I'm sure he had good reason. Hey, I'll go look for him. Zach, you wait here. Mm. All right, I'll wait here. But, I'm pretty antsy. Yeah, I know. That obvious? <laughs> hmm. 
Theft is theft, no matter the reason. I'll have to give him a good scolding. And squats, of course. Ugh, that's it! It's my wallet that was stolen. I'm gonna look for Bruno, too. I think he went that way. Ooh, there's the save point. A shop for me? Welcome, shopper, to the item shop. Welcome, shop. No, I cannot. New mission available. Let's save first. And then check the mission. Monster research project. Monsters in Midgar. Defend the slums firing. Level 2. Rank 2. Residents of the slum have decided to take matters into their own hands to fight the monsters. I'll hurry there and eliminate the monster before any of the slum residents are hurt. It's a rank 2. Let's do it. And there doesn't seem to be any chests. Just follow the mark and go to the boss. Activating combat mode. Out of the way! Oh Conflict yeah! Resolved. That would have been difficult because they reckon health a lot. But Dark Mistle, ooh, it's so good. Okay, then, Monster Research Project, Monster Stream, you good. Oh, okay. Now that's done, how do I get back to the other side to speak with the kid? I guess I'll take a look through the market first. Oh, yeah. I cannot do that then. You have your mail from Lazar. Children in the slum, soldier members, I thank you for your daily hard work. On the ground, beneath our aerial city of Midgar and in the shadow of its plates lie the slums. They also symbolize one of Shinra's distortions. There are reports of children forming gangs in the harsh environment they call home. To look away from this will surely cast a large shadow in Shinra's future growth. It is my hope that we members of soldier can rise up to address this distortion. Did he go out from here? Hey, you there! Did a kid come running this way? A little boy? A little boy? Don't know. Although, children never come this way. I see. Got your pocket pick, did you? Huh? Happens all the time here. But you're gonna have a hard time finding the thief on your own. Ask folks around here nicely, and they might help you. Yeah, that's a good point. Right. I'll ask around here, for starters. Let me think. I just saw a boy running frantically by the accessory shop. What is the accessory shop? Excuse me. Welcome. What do you need? Uh, no, I'm not shopping. All right. I'm looking for a kid named Bruno who took my wallet. Maybe you've seen him around? He looks like this. Never seen him, but I'll keep an eye out. You're the man! Thanks! Where did he go? There he is! Hey, mister! That's him! Get him! Whoa, whoa! This kid's pretty fast. Hey, what's the deal? Uh, he's gone. Yeah, sorry. I'm really not that quick on my feet. You had no intention of chasing him. 
No, that's not true at all. Come on, man. Zach! Hey, Aerith. Did you find him yet? Not yet, but give me time, please. I guess we keep asking then. Hey there. I'm looking for someone. A little boy named Bruno. Yeah, I know Bruno. You must want to find him badly. I'll bring him here for you, okay? You will? Yeah, stay right here. All right, I'll be waiting. Hmm. <laughs> it's sure taking a long time. I definitely have been tricked, but I will wait a little longer. Wait a little longer. Wait a little longer. A little longer. I wonder how many times can I do this? Ugh, that's it. Don't How far did she have to go? Huh? Hey! That's the kid who took... Oh, no. You talk too soon. You know, I was just about to catch him. Weren't you trying to help him get away? No, I wasn't. That's so mean. <laughs> Come on, man. I wonder if Aerith is still looking. All by herself. You, you! Oh, no! Never mind. I'm just a Shinra trooper on patrol. Huh? Who is that suspicious guy? Hey, excuse me. I'm looking for a little boy named Bruno. He looks like this. I haven't seen... Wait, I did see him. Really? That way, I think. That way? Why? Yes, yes, way down there. Great, thanks. D hey! Wait! He's over by you! <sighs> He's gone! Why does he keep running in circles? Hey, That's lady! What gives? <laughs> I didn't mean to trick you! I just have really bad eyesight. Come on, man. Oh, I see. I'll come back. Hmm? Hey, Aerith! Zach! Did you find him yet? Um, no. But give me more time. I'll find him. This is quite frustrating. Once and twice is okay to do this, but hmm, it's getting too too much. Aerith, how goes? Zach. What should I do here? Talk to Aerith. <laughs> There's no need to look so worried. It's just bad luck. Hey, why don't we look together? Uh, but... Don't worry about it. I'm not gonna yell at him straight from the top. I'll ask him why he did it. And I'll forgive him if it was for a good reason. Really? Yes, really. Okay, let's go look. Yeah, but we still have no leads. If Bruno needed money, he should still be around here. Yeah. Then you stay here and keep an eye out. I'll go take a look around town. Let's try that, okay? Downtown, search for the child who stole your wallet. Where? Where do I search for him? 
Aha! I found you! Uh. Whoa! Okay. No more running. Finally! All right. You know what you did was bad, don't you? You should never steal from people. Zack? <sighs> because it's very, very wrong. Now, tell me why you did it. None of your business. Why you... <sighs> Bruno, did you really steal? Yes. I see. So, why did you do that? <clears throat> you know, Aerith believed in you. No matter what I said, she insisted you're a good boy. You can shut me out, but tell Aerith the truth. Do you need money? Tell me why. I need medicine, but my wallet was eaten by a monster. That's why I took this guy's wallet. I thought, if he's your friend, he might give me a break. Bruno, this was bad. You know that. Don't do it again. Okay. Okay, good. Now we're friends again. Zach, you agree? You believe in him, so yes. Thank you. I'm sorry. But you need medicine, right? Yeah. It's for my grandpa. Looks like this kid is in a real bind. I'll get your wallet back from the monster. I'll buy the medicine for you. I'll buy it for you. Huh? Really? Zach, are you sure? Yeah. Buy it with my money, okay? Thanks so wait! It's no good! There's not enough here! <laughs> Seriously? Okay, I'll get your money back from the monster. But I need it's to fight it dangerous. nevertheless. Don't you worry. Monsters around here are cake. Okay, but I'm going to. No, it'll be fine. Just let me handle it. Stay here and wait with Bruno. The monsters should still be on the path that goes to the park, I think. Here's your wallet and money. There was only a little money in there to begin with. I didn't spend any. Okay, okay, I got it. Retrieve the wallet from the monster. Okay, let's save this before we do anything else. And then move which way? This way. <sighs> um, the park is this way. Hey, you! Get back inside the gate now! Hmm? Monsters! Coming out of the park in droves! The park? All right, that's gotta be them. It's not all right! Everyone's fled! It's dangerous. You have to turn back now. Sorry, but they owe me some money. So I have to go over and collect. What? What the hell are you talking about, guy? Relax, relax. Don't worry about me. You know, you should get behind that gate yourself. Go on, get inside the gate. Stay here. Here we go. This is them. Bruno's wallet, here I come. You yeah, don't you like if they ate the wallet, are you going to how do I say this? Open them up? Conflict resolved. Oh, here we are. One wallet. Well that was is easy. the money still inside? Whoa! That's way more than I have. Wow! 
Wow, you really got it back. Amazing. Ugh, it's so sticky. Stop complaining. At least you got it back. Zach, were you okay? No problem at all. Piece of cake. Thanks a lot, mister. Call me Zach. If you need more help, just ask. You don't need to steal anymore. Hmm. Thanks, but you've got bigger money problems than me. <sighs> well, maybe so. But hey, just you wait. Aerith and I, we're gonna make a fortune. Huh? We're launching Operation Midgar Full of Flowers, Wallet Full of Money. <laughs> yes, Midgar Full of Flowers and Wallet Full of Money. Aerith, for real? Yeah, for real. That's why, if you're in trouble, we can help you. All right, I'll come talk to you. Okay, mister. Aerith, thanks. Hey, Zach. Did you mean it? Selling the flowers? Of course. There's no turning back after this. I know. Let's make a wagon. A wagon? Yes, a flower wagon. With a wagon to carry lots of flowers, you could sell them all over Midgar. Hmm. Oh, not feeling it? No, no, it's great. Let's do it. Look around the slums market. Okay, set. Let's save and end this episode here. So if you've made it this far, thank you very much for joining and hopefully I see you in the next one. Goodbye.